Hello and welcome to Infinity. Sometimes you get a sky where sort of one side of it is sort of blue, but the other side sort of fades sideways to white. And there's a puzzle as to what to do about this. Here's a couple of ways that you can go about it. First of all, we're just going to protect the building here with a selection. So I click the selection brush here. I'm going to select the sky. Snap to edges is on. So I'm just going to a single clicks around here. I'm going to paint down there. And fill in the sky, then Alt click to reverse it. And there we go. And that will do. And we could do you know, a quick refine on it. How's that? You can see it's not perfect there, but it'll do because I'm just going to show the method, not spend ages doing a perfect selection. Now, what we're going to do here then is we want to sort of copy from this side to this side over here. So the first way to do it is you go to the clone brush, which is down here. Click on this. And then I want to copy from over here to over here. And normally you alt click somewhere and then when you click somewhere else, it follows you around the little X. It copies from where the X is to the where the brush is. Control Z to get rid of that. But here's a way you can sort of copy from the other side. So I go to over here, sort of up in the corner, and Alt click there, put the X up there. Then the flip thing here, I'm going to go from that to horizontal. Then when I go over here, I'm going to start copying what's over there. So if you look at the X on the right hand side, as I move right here, it comes in towards the middle. And so I can just paint down here and it paints inwards. And so we're going to meet in the middle, which is kind of fun, really. You've got to watch out for where that X is going because I want it to go over things. So now and again, you lift, lift the finger off the mouse so otherwise you're going to have to sort of start again. So this is going to go when it gets to overlapping in the middle like that stop because that means you've copied in the middle. I'm going to copy here and watch out for down here. You don't want to go over the building and then you can sort of tidy up. But there you go there's sort of copied it from one side to the other side. Okay I'm just going to undo that just show another way of doing it, which is that I just going to go control C, control V, which means I pasted another layer on top. But now I'm going to flip that layer. So I go to arrange, then flip horizontal. That just flips the current layer. But now this is because you've got the same thing on top of each other backwards. But because we've got a selection here, we can use that. So all I go down to here is click on the mask layer. And now I got that selected. But now I got this bit over here, so I just want to mask that out. So on the, the mask itself, to make sure I've got the mask selected here, I'm going to paint black on it to get rid of that. So I go to the paintbrush and get a soft and full brush is fine. So from here, I'm just going to paint, just look underneath to where it's going to go. And there we go, I'll just paint that out there. And there we go, we again rebalance the sky by echoing both sides. There you go, a couple of ways of doing it, and it can fix that problem of one side being lighter than the other side. Thank you very much for watching.